Hi, I'm Libby Harlow and I'm doing Twelfth Night Act 2, Scene 2. I'm playing the character Viola. In the beginning of the scene, Olivia tasks Malvolio with delivering a ring to Viola, who is dressed up as Cesario. Viola is confused about Olivia's message to her until she realises that Olivia has fallen in love with her because she thinks she is Cesario. Viola feels sympathy for Olivia, as Olivia's love for her is as impossible as her own love for Asino. And both Olivia and Viola have fallen in love with people who do not love them back. Viola's speech perfectly outlines this love triangle between herself, Orsino, and Olivia. The reason I wanted to perform this monologue is because I think it's so interesting to see the different genders, gender, gender aspects of each of the characters. For example, Viola is dressed up as a man, Cesario, and therefore treated like a man. This then gives Viola a unique perspective into the world of men from a woman's point of view. It very clearly highlights the biases of how each gender are treated differently. Though Viola's disguise is liberating and freeing, it also causes unwanted problems later on. I want my audience to sympathise with Viola, as I think all of us have told lies, which have then led to bigger problems later on. I also want to make you guys laugh, as it was written as a comedy and meant to be funny. So I hope you enjoy. I left no ring with her. What means this lady? Fortune forbid my outsides has not charmed her. She made good view of me. Indeed, so much that sure me thought her eyes had lost her tongue. For she did speak and starts distractedly. She loves me. Sure. With the cunning of her passion invites me in this churlish messenger. None of my Lord's ring. Why he sent her none. I am the man. If it be so as tis, poor lady, she were better love a dream. Disguise, I see thou art a wickedness, wherein the pregnant enemy does much. How will this badge? My master loves her dearly, and I, poor monster, wonders much on him, and she, mistaken, seems to dote on me. What will become of this? As I am man, my state is desperate for my master's love. As I am woman, now, alas, the day what thriftness I shall poorly be a breed. O oh, time, thou must untangle this, not I. It is too hard enough for me to untie. Thank you for watching. <laughs>